Here we go. Woo! There are activities all day long, and the environment is lovely. John's been in the crossings for about 18 months, and often that's about the length that a dementia patient will go through a stage of the disease. And actually, I'm very happy because I didn't think we would make it that long. We've been able to stay in the stage we're in for longer because he is mentally stimulated and he's happy. It's important to keep my residents with dementia and Alzheimer's uh, active and engaged uh, to keep that cognitive stimulation flowing. Uh, the purpose of the crossings is to kind of keep dementia at bay. Uh, we understand that we can't stop it, but we can definitely try to slow it down. Should we start another row right here then? Probably have to, okay. yeah. The types of programs that I do to engage John uh, really depend on his past interest. John, for example, is somebody who enjoys woodworking. Uh, he and I actually build houses and we donate them to preschools, which is fantastic. And you can really see that moment of joy for John and the engagement that we have when we're creating those houses. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Good. One. I attend some of the programs with him, especially when I know there's a good music program coming. I'm a part of that community too, and I may eat lunch with him, or I may pick something up and we'll have dinner in his apartment while we're talking or looking at books or whatever it is we're going to do that day. So you have the, the safety, the comfort, the help, but you also have the flexibility to live your own lives.